Hi everybody, welcome back to Borderlands 2. My name is Mikey Dubs. In today's video, we are rocking some Zero the Assassin in the randomized rogue lands. I'm also going to be live on stream for this video, talking to the chat as things come up. So, enjoy the stream, enjoy the video. If you guys want to jump in on the streams, I'm going to be going live. It's it's somewhat sporadically right now, but I, I think Fridays is a pretty consistent day. Like I'm calling it Fan Fridays, a pretty consistent day for me to go live. Um, it's a great time. Jump into the stream. Anyways, let's see what we can get done here. A shock damage and a sniper rifle damage. Relic art. Nice to get off rip. Let's see what we can grab. I see cloud kill at the bottom here. I haven't gotten money shot in a bunch of rounds and I'm kind of missing it. I see ward. I see preparation. Hmm... Okay, so Cloud Kill's not really a build around, I don't think. Realistically, it's it's not really. I would say... These first kills are pretty atrocious. Bad. Bad. Good. Bad. This is one of the worst... This has got to be one of the worst skill trees I've ever seen. We do have Death Blossom, but we don't have Death Mark. So what's the point of it? Oh, I do have Death Mark. Okay, sick, sick, sick. Okay, so, okay. Okay, actually, this isn't so bad. Let's do... Let's do Do or Die for one. And then it's... Then it's Preparation. And then we're just going to try to get through... As long as we can get through... Wait, what? No, I'm good. Yeah. As long as I can get through this first stage without dying, then I can start death marking kids. Let's go. Alright, yeah. Early death mark is gonna be super, super nice. If you guys don't know how this works, death mark. Melee attacks, mark the target for death, first horde duration. Mark targets take additional damage from all sources. Also, it's not an easy thing to live with. That's funny. Uh, they take 80% additional damage from all sources, which is really, really nice. And kunai is the capstone. Action skill augment. Press Q while deception is active to throw a handful of kunai. Each kunai will explode with a random element type. Kunai do not benefit from deception damage bonuses, but throwing kunai does not end deception and it can apply death mark. GG. So if we can slag and death mark lads, then we'll be doing just fine damage wise. And a couple different snipers should be worth it. Um. I think shock damage might come in handy here. I don't have any shock damage weapons, so until I do, let's just do sniper rifle gun damage. Let's run it. Let's run it. Don't hit me. Oh, I do have a shock damage. I have a shock damage weapon now. Let's rock it. Shock damage. I don't have... I don't have kunai or uh, death mark yet, so I have to get through this round first. Once I get through this round, yeah. Kind of a lucky round to get. Maybe I can just one-shot him with tosses. Yeah, much much safer, much better, much quicker. Spawn him underneath me, why don't you? Later. Oh, Juke City, population you. Juke City, population you. Okay. Let's run it. Oh, yeah. You're wrecked, kid. Five out of ten already. We're looking juicy, juicy. Good. Very much I'm enjoying the extra shock damage. Oh my goodness. This guy, he walks out the door, walks out the store, grabs the barrel and says, you know what? I'm going to blow it up right there. You've lived here for how long? How long have you been stationed here? These guys, this is the the least challenging area of all time. Ow. Okay, I shouldn't have said anything. Later, kid. Later, kid. Okay. We officially have a way to get death mark on kids. Randomized death mark is nice. One point in Fearless. So this right side skill tree is probably the best. It's got things like Smart Lighter Faster. It's got things like uh, Preparation. And not to mention Fleet. We are really going to be depending on... Oh, I went with a gun too for Sniper Rifle Damage and Cloud Kill. Okay. What, what does this one do? Many Must Fall. Oh, I do. I have the, I have the, I have the melee damage synergy, but I don't have enough me extra bonus melee damage. Is my problem. I have many most fall alongside execute, but I don't have any other melee damage bonuses. 
So like if if that got sounds the voices this run or something like that, yeah, I'd be all about it. But unfortunately, I just don't have the juice to keep it up. Let's go velocity for two. Probably be worth it. And now we just hope for a cooldown relic, and we try to, and we try to death mark everything. Question: Does this skill over here give me cooldown reduction? I don't see any cooldown reduction at all. None. Yeah, no cooldown reduction. It's just tough, but it is what it is. There's plenty of other ways to get cooldown reduction. Right there, 30, 32%. Is that better? I would say it probably is better, to be honest with you. A lot of our damage, I think, is going to come from Kunai. Okay. Let's see, a Pushka Sniper, a Chinook Sniper. Kind of like the idea of this one right here. Oh, that's a Ravager, though. Let's equip that Ravager. It's got a Hyperion grip instead of a Torg, but that's fine. Okay. We're starting to get a little bit stronger now. Let's see, cooldown rate, 16%. The critical hit damage is probably pretty nice, too. Plus 6 velocity, though, in this one? Holy, brother. That's perfect for me. Yeah, I'm gonna kunai. Kunai and blue nai. <laughs> What's he talking about? The axe gag. Get one shot, brother. I even get a crit. Where's my crit? Show me that crit. Hey! Go down. Okay, how about some- how about a better cooldown relic? One kill at a time here. Go ahead, scream. Oh. Wait, where? Come on, land that crit. Dang, that was a tough, a tough shot to try to hit. Max health. And, oh, better cooldown, right? Perfect. That's, that's what I was asking for. Appreciate that. See you later, homie. Sun's in my eyes. I can't see anything. <laughs> Squinting in the sun. Alright, yak skag. Boom. See ya. Okay. This extra cool now, right? In my highly developed brain, I will create destruction. All right, let's give you two. Give you one and you one. Mm, didn't quite work out the way I thought it would, but we're making it. Later, kid. Nice. And oh, ultimate badass fire skag, huh? Oh, get one shot. Let's go. He actually got one shot. Crazy. So, but these extra points in velocity, I'm going to keep going into it. And then rising shot. Come on, if I do. Okay. Take this stop. But I'm at the 1.0.9, or with the 1.0.9 update, I don't actually take any extra damage after the round is over, which we found out together. For sure that we can't grenade jump to the areas anymore which is a tough a tough thing okay so with velocity this ravager is actually quite quite strong and plus six in it puts me at 11 out of five which gives me 22 percent gun damage plus 33 percent critical hit damage and plus 220 percent bullet speed which is really nice for rockets I completely wasted this power up, by the way. So I, I want to I form at the stage for sure. Okay, a Tesla. I think a Singularity, but I don't have Boar or anything like that. The Tesla might just be best. You don't mind if I do with that quad, probably? Yeah, don't mind if I do. We can shoot it twice as well. Sick. Like in where we're at. Like in where we're at. Mm -mm. Okay. 
Okay. I did I cleared this in a kind of a weird order, but bear with me here. So is that a synergy? It is. I like the synergy. And the, the anarchy wouldn't dare show its face after a synergy drops. It knows it would get overshadowed. The anarchist, I should say. Two best pistols, in my opinion, in the game. Non-unique. Anarchist and synergy. Both extremely good. Longbow transfusion with a 0.7 second fuse time. That's what I'm looking for. Let's go. It's not slag though. I don't have a I don't have a consistent way to slag. Alright, lads, let's go. I'm definitely gonna go for the Ravager here. Get some kunai out. Oh man. Oh golly. Save that green power for next round. Never punished. Later. Cross this. Oh, see you later, homie. Feeling strong. Later. If I had a little bit of reload speed, that'd be nice too. Ooh. Good. First stage one, this is incredibly good. Okay. A Hulk, no thanks. Okay. I don't think I've got any way to really juice up my mags, do I? I got Foresight, which is a little bit of magazine. It won't be enough to get me another shot, I don't think. Yeah, no way to really juice up my mags too, too much. I should probably stop going down this skill tree. Now that I'm thinking about it. And do or die is increasing my grenade damage, which is nice. Plus a singularity out there. Or not singularity, a, a transfusion, even though I don't really need it. Come on down, the water's fine. Later, kid. Too easy. Too easy for your lad. Okay. And for our next five, I... I, do, I really need to keep going down this coach. I don't think I do. That's the, that's the thing about it. I don't think I do. I think I would rather go Foresight. Yeah. A Rising Shot is good and all. It, it, it really is. I can, and I can definitely throw more points back into it later on. But I kind of want to get some defense going. And this is what it's going to give me. Onslaught's also going to give me a bunch of movement speed. Insight as well for reload speed too. Okay. This build should have juice. I think this build... We have enough good... Enough good skills to to get us there i think we can just keep getting through rounds doing what we're doing Ooh, i was really hoping that'd be a a droog but Let's see torque fire rate and torque magazine size yep let's do it get four shots now four shots for your boy Pandarax crack. This time I got I got the damage for these guys, right? Surely. I dare Witch Doctor to show his ugly face. Come on, Witch. Yeah, go ahead. Show your ugly face. Wait for the last second. Blast them. Get one shot. Oh, that's so satisfying. So satisfying to one shot that lad. Takes all my takes all four shots of a Ravager to take out that guy, but this is what it is. I need to deception. I'm a little bit stuck here. Where'd that guy go? back over here get him destroy him don't let him heal yes no witch doctors not on my watch no witch doctors there we go deception as soon as it comes up oh you're gonna wish you hadn't done that this is kunai am oh kunai has splash damage well today we learned today we learned we run that one back Today we learned. Speaking of learned, someone says, you know you can find patch notes on Pyrex's GitHub page, right? I searched and searched and searched for the, the patch notes and I did not find them. I did my due diligence. But let's get our new seed going here. We had a really good run going, but... Unfortunately, we kind of threw it by being point blank when that... 
And that kunai went off. <laughs> okay, let's see what skills we get this time. Mm, I, I see boar. I see boar and I see cloud kill. I like that combo. Deathmark, do I get kunai? The game, there's no way that game is going to give it to me. It's not going to reward me. No way. It's like, you, you just killed yourself with kunai. You expect us to give it to you again? I understand. I get it. I wouldn't give it to me either. Let's go for... Let's see... Lay Waste. Yeah, Matson, if you could... If you could tell me where to find that, because... I searched the GitHub page, and then I, I ended up going, I, I asked Pyrex himself where I can find the, the patch notes, and he didn't actually tell me, he just told me that all I did today was add god mode, so. Like, I, if you look at the forum, I'm the one who asked. And that's where you're getting the information, and I was the one who did that. I couldn't find the patch notes anywhere, so. Let's rock! It's Aegis for a little bit of slag and glag. And maybe this, this bandit could be decent. And how my build is going to work as of right now is killing an enemy increases fire rate and critical hit damage. Top right corner of the GitHub page. I, I'll check it out. Okay. Pistol max ammo or sawful max ammo. Okay, that, those both can be useful in the right situations. I need to get one kill, and then once I get one kill, what is it? It's check it one more time. It's fire rate and critical hit damage. Okay. So once I get one kill, start aiming for for crits. I should always be aiming for crits. Oh, I'm, I'm back in the corner. Okay, get a kill. The fire rate alone will be enough to help us out. He resists fire, but he doesn't resist fire to the face. There we go. Finally. At least it's not a rabbit skag. Give me that booster. Hey, hey, hey! Chill out. Come on, birds. Super badass wreck. Come on, go for a dive bomb. I dare ya. Come on, go for a dive bomb. They're, they're interested in somebody else, despite me being the one that's doing all the damage to them. It is what it is. Pepper Corner, 1.0.8 is. So you're saying that the 1.0.9 patch notes are not on there. Is what you're saying. <laughs> so is the 1.0.9 patch notes on there or no on the top right? Because otherwise, I'm just going to be assume that you saw the, qu the, the post I said. And, t and now you're coming to this chat to tell me that you know you can find the patch notes somewhere. So now I'm definitely going to have to look. I don't think anyone spent more time searching for those patch notes than I did. Okay, a little bit of fire sky action. Not bad. One point oh. Yeah, I did. I knew it. This guy. <laughs> Look, I I'm here for banter, okay? I, I, I'm not. This guy comes in here. The first thing he says. You know you can find patch notes on Paris's GitHub page, right? Which ten? Okay, okay. Respect. Not an incorrect statement. Not an incorrect statement. Okay. Um, not an incorrect statement. However says you can find the patch notes but then he says 1.0.9 only adds god mode and I, I saw the word only in there and I was like um uh, only that sounds exactly like the response that Pyrex gave me when I was asking about where the patch notes are it turns out that the patch notes aren't available online that the where the guy got the information was from my forum post crazy absolutely crazy 
1.0.8 adds offline mode once you start the game customizable in the options i do know that but there's a lot more to the 1.0.8 uh, update 1.0.8 changed the game entirely come on give me there i think it was the 1.0.8 update that gave us That gave us the ability to um, end the rounds after. No, sorry. I only looked at the source code and comments. Yeah, see? Oh, the reason why I'm fired up about it is because I spent so much time. I spent so much time looking for those patch notes. And then someone says, hey, you know, you can find them, right? I'm like, there's just no way. There's no way those 1.0.9 patch notes are up there. Yeah, it turns out the person was just stealing my information and passing it off as their own. Crazy, crazy. Okay, so. Let's take four. I went with the gun. I think, since I don't really have a direction for this build, I think maybe hip firing sniper rifles can be the way. Is there anything else I want to build towards before then? Yeah, probably. Probably cloud kill. C commits, not comments. How? What are comments? That's not a word. I just saw you. Oh. Comments. Comments. C O M M I T S. On the GitHub page on the Rogue Lands mod, I can only find patch notes for the two year old version of the mod. You just gotta learn how to read GitHub. Commits isn't a word. Well, I guess, no, you could, if they, more one more than one person commits to an action. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. But why would you ever, with the commit notes, you can figure it out. Okay, so it looks like you can. Okay, okay. Sorry, Matson. Sorry. Sorry. Okay, I came, I came for your life. I came for your life. I'll be checking. I'll be. I'll, I will now be doing a very thorough search. If I, you know what? Let's let's pause the YouTube video. Someone might get banned here. Okay, so th there will not be a banning today. Um, it looks like we can find the patch notes, but I mean, look at look at how convoluted this is. You have to go to the GitHub page. I guess you have to kind of be in the know. But here's how you find it. If you guys want to find the patch notes for Rogue Lands. You got to go to type in on Google GitHub Roguelands Pyrex, okay? And you're going to find the Pyrex BOJ page. He's got his own page, okay? This is Pyrex slash BOK SDK mods, okay? Then now click on Roguelands game mode. And then over here to the right hand side, you will see a history button. Click on that history button. And now you can click on the, the version. And then boom, here's your note. Turns God mode on at the end of the round if they kill all enemies at the end of the round setting is on. There you go. There's a whole bunch of code here as well. Let's take a look at some of the other. Add a new mod setting. Okay. Very cool. You can also click on the three dots to expand the notes. Oh, okay. Let's do that. Let's expand these notes. This is worth it, guys. Oh, I see. Removed Motor Mama. Oh! Motor Mama is gone. Okay, big update. Uh, on this big update... Oh, Pyrex is getting so exposed. On this big update, there's just no... There's, there's nothing. But I guess if you, if you could read code... If you could recode, you could do this. Okay, very, very cool. All right, let's jump back into the rogue lens. Oh, and also, here's the... He wasn't wrong. Here's the commits. Whatever that means. All right, let's roll. All right, we're back. 15 out of 15. All right, so there was no banning. He survived. Crazy. I thought, I thought for sure he was going to get banned. Let's take some ambush. But true, now you got to navigate GitHub to build a bit to find that. Yeah. You do gotta navigate it, but at least it's there, right? 
at least there's an option for you if you want to find it let's roll glad I could, yeah matson says glad i could help after i flamed him for like 10 minutes straight like it's not there it's not there and like it is there it is there don't get me wrong do i have boar yet i think i do oh yeah a little bit of boar a little bit of boar, boar for your life do I have a singularity grenade yet hey get out of here Okay, go down. And now I know where to find the patch notes. I mean, I'm not so sure how many more Rogue Lands updates we're going to get. I do think, though, I mean, my channel popularity is going a little bit up. And I think that's going to mean that either there's more people interested in playing the game or there's more people that are playing the game. How about that Sticky Lab Singularity, though? That one goes out to... I got this. I know this name. I know this name. That one goes out to Jarrett, my boy Jarrett, reminding me to always take the Singularity Grenades. Um, with Boar plus Singularity, this should be a little bit easier to pull off here. A Fire Brachny? Yep, let's do it. For this zone, you don't really need Boar, but... I right, toss this bad Larry down, get pulled in. Nobody around to bore, actually. Here we go. You can bore a lot of enemies just by hitting them. I feel like there's enough enemies in the game that can just be... straight up bored by shooting through their own character model. Like, just like that. Like, where's that bore coming from? Okay, so let's take a, a quick shot. Might as well. And I'm going to take hip fire with snipe rifles. Some people might say that not a worthwhile skill. I kind of like the extra hip fire accuracy with sniper rifles. Yeah. And it gives you reload speed and mag size. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Let's grab this pressure pad and head out. Wolf Girl 1337 says, I used to bother with writing patch notes for my repo, but it's so annoying, especially when you know... No one reads it. Well, I'm reading it. But yeah, I, I get that. I mean, I definitely get that. Ooh, that that muck muck has over 100,000 damage. Ravager. Listen, to, as I like the Ravager a lot. But I think I might be just sniper pilled. On top of that, I think it has a TD or grip. And a blade. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna disrespect the Ravager by putting that on. I know that it's not gonna perform. Well, it's gonna perform. It's, it's not gonna perform uh as much as it could. Okay, let's roll. Do I have a corrosive sniper rifle? In my travels, did I find one? No, I didn't. Okay, so I think I'm just going to go with this muck -a muck then. And I have some points in ambush, so... Toss that out. Pop goes the weasel. Get one shot. Oh, I didn't even wake up his lad. Get that crit. Oh, I need, I need deception out. Oh, wait. Hold on a second here. This could go nuclear. Deception. Plus another singularity down. Buy me some time. Oh, you guys are going to get toasted and roasted. Uh, One more singularity, if you don't mind. Reload me. Reload me. Cross. Oh, gosh. I'm taking a lot of damage. I'm back. I'm pinned. I'm pinned. I'm pinned. Oh, we're so back. Later, kid. Health regen me. Health regen me. Health regen me. Launcher max ammo. Bandit fire rate. I'm slagged. I gotta be really careful what I do here. Us one more singularity down. Oh, yeah. What a shot. How did you survive back there? I'm that dude. Seriously. Pirates and Jolts announced there will be no big updates to Rogue Lands, only small bug fixes from now on. Mm, we'll see about that. If I if I shame them enough, they'll do it. All I have to do to change someone's mind is change their mind, so.
Ooh, give me that quad, brother. With a matching grip. Let's go. Okay, so I did take the sniper rifle skill, but... And if you're gonna give me a nice big old quad, that'd be nice too. Um... Let's do a... It's tough. So you wanna... You don't wanna waste any points. I wanna get down the cloud kill. Hmm... Let's take quick draw for five. And this way, what I can do is... I think I can, I can probably slag and bag now. How long does that last? Increase weapon swap speed and critical- Oh, wait, no. It's just, it just gives me critical hit damage. Okay, that's not bad. Not bad at all. What's up, little man? Welcome. Oh, ogre meat. Let's go! Okay, this is... The ogre is definitely a respectable weapon. So we do have a assault rifle max ammo relic. Let's use that. And I want to get down to this now. Let's do weapon swap speed. Max size. Max size. Oh, yeah. And let's do lay waste. I'm not sure if the ogre can crit, but let's go. I haven't used the ogre in forever. I'm excited to use it. And my mag size is absolutely ludicrous. Not bad on big sleep, honestly. Whoa, whoa, chill, chill, chill. Let's couple grenades out. Really not bad damage, realistically. Oh. I feel like when you unspec boar, you still get it. I still get the, I still get the sound for it and everything. A rapier? Maybe last round, not this round, brother. Whoa, whoa, chill, chill. Okay. I talked to Pyrex about the updates to the game, and he told me that he's, since he worked so long on it, that it's this is kind of his time to kind of sit back, relax, and just watch, you know, people enjoy the game, which... Which I totally understand. But Pyrex, update the game. <laughs> go for this guy instead. There we go. I know that I can crit now, which is nice. Just, just keep firing, I guess. Sandman's too hard of a target to hit. Let's hit this guy instead. Give me that booster. Give me that booster. Singularity. Hey, stop running. Thank you. I really wish you can go infinite in rogue lands. Mmm, true. Infinite modes in rogue lights are interesting. A lot of times, unless they get really hard really quick. Um, like, I think... I think a, a roguelike that really showed the world how to properly do infinite is Bellatro that just came out this year. Because Bellatro, how it works is like the final round of like the final boss where you need to get like 300,000 points or something like that. Um, but wait, how does this accuracy work? So see how much this is spinning around. Let's see if I take this accuracy relic. What's it look like now? It's still... I mean, it's more accurate, that's for sure. Hmm. Okay, let's take boar. I think we stop there. Although I do want some of that grenade damage. But I think we owe it to ourselves to get down to this cloud kill. It is tough. It's definitely tough. Let's take this for a little bit of heal regen. Let's go. Team critical hit damage. What am I what are my options right now as far as class mods? Cooldown rate. I, I, I think I'll stick with the the accuracy. I think accuracy gets a little bit of a bad rap. 
a lot of Borderlands players, when they talk about stats that matters, stats that matter, um, they leave out accuracy. I think personally, I think I think it's underrated pretty heavily. That's my last shovel, right there. That's what I was saying. So, and in, in Bellatro, like yeah, you need like three hundred something thousand points to get through the final round most of the time, and it, it can fluctuate, you know, give or take here and there. Oh, sorry, full and sniper max ammo, oh, geez. But the final boss, I'm mean, sorry, an infinite, like, you end up jumping from like 300,000 on round uh, eight to like, by the time that you get to like round 10 or something like that, you, you are well within the millions. Like, to beat like round 12, it's something like, I don't know, like 20 something million. Like, it's, or it gets ridiculous. So you have to really have a run going um, in Bellatro to to make it an infinite it's not like these other infinite modes that are just it slowly progresses up and slowly progresses up and slowly no it is like do you got to build or do you not got to build because infinite is for where, where you go to when you got to build build which i i personally like I, i'm getting way too many of these of these class mods that i can't decide whether or not i want them the crit damage might come in handy 52% with ambush. Oh, it's Saturn. I don't know if I got the gusto for this guy. Unless, of course, the chest. Well, oh, fire rate plus 32%. Real speed and shield capacity. Um, I'm not too sure. Let's just run for my life, though, for a second. Oh, we're definitely going to one. Oh, brother. I, was, I, I, I saw that. I saw that attack coming and I still got whacked by it. Those are some I think those are some pretty nice grenade tosses to be honest with you. Let's get let's get in the cheese spot. Get in the cheese spot. Get in the cheese spot. Oh, we're there. Risk of Rain 2 is also kinda hard. Um Yeah, Risk of Rain 2 has the Eclipse 8 game mode, which is pretty tough. Oh yeah. Can we get me back in there? Come on. Come on, transfusions. Help me out. I'm gonna hide right here. Hopefully these missiles don't make it to me. Okay. Now my turn. This guy's hiding though. He's got a pretty good hiding spot over there, homie. Yes, the boar. When he has his legs turned, we can really pump some damage into him. Exception that way. Oh, I I, I made a mistake. Can I shoot through this? Yeah, I can. Sorry, brother. I know it's not that fair, but I don't care. The yeah, Risk of Rain 2 is an absolutely amazing game. Yeah, th that game scales up pretty well, but even that game, I feel like it's a little bit easier to hit God Mode status um, in that game than, say, Bellatro or something like that, but I could be wrong. I feel like Risk of Rain 2 is just you just stack up all these items and then as soon as you get ceremonial daggers in the end game, everything just dies. Okay. So I started going down this this skill tree. I think that it could probably be worth keeping up with it. Take flicker. Total shield. Let's take it. Alright. Give me some decent some decent uh Loot here. Let's see. The crit, the heartbreaker is Dece. Actually, the Terramorphous is kind of mad. A creamer and a hive. I wish I had the hive for this fight. So let's go for, let's get that creamer out here for my, my new go-to launcher. Here we go. Heartbreaker in here for healing purposes. Let's rock, let's rock today. Okay. I think that's going to be it for me this round for me. Let's roll. Let's roll. Okay. Mm, do I want anything from there quite yet? No. I think what we're really going to looking for is a game changing weapon like a peak opener. Another ogre, huh? You say. Not worth using that, I don't think. 
A Thompson. How about, a, how about like a peak opener? Ooh, a couple unkept heralds. It's double penetrating. How am I, how, how am I supposed to not? How am I supposed to not? All right, so. It's pistol all day, every day. And what's also really nice about zero is that you get pistol gun damage. Super sick. And because we now we we're using a pistol instead of an assault rifle, we can respec. Um so we definitely gonna want boar still. And let's see, ambush. Is it ambush or is it lay waste? I think for this round it's ambush. And it's boar. Do or die is gonna give me a lot of extra grenade damage. Which could be worth it. 5, 10, 15, 20, but we can't get, we can't get down the cloud kill. Let's just do quick draw into Foresight, into Two Fang, into Mylan. Okay, and maybe even a little bit of grit for your life. Maybe even a little bit of grit for your life. Let's rock, let's rock today. Double penetrating, uncapped herald, get me there. Not Pyro Pete, brother. Dang it. All right, you know what? Here's the strat. Forget Pyro Pete. Let's forget it. Forget he even exists. We are going to go for power ups only. Because this, my gun is not strong enough to kill this lad. Green power ups only. Kill the lads until we get power ups. I really do not want to fight him the regular way. I mean, I could. I've done it enough times. Um, do I got something slack. I just want to slag him up a little bit here. Okay. Slag him up a little bit. Let's just see how much damage we can do. Ben Clare says, hey, buddy. Great. Sh oh, hold on. I gotta, I gotta focus. Sorry, Ben Claire. Give me a second. What's this game mode called? This is called Rogue Lance. This is a mod for Borderlands 2 that you can get on PC, and I've heard that you can get on Steam Deck as well. well not, don't quote me on the Steam Deck portion. It's actually not so bad damage. Let's keep spawning in Spider Rants to, to cleanse our debuff. Okay. One fan coming in handy here. It's actually really good damage for Power Pete. Not gonna lie to you, so. Let's just keep it on him. Oh, especially with that boar coming in. Holy. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Don't pin yourself into a corner, brother. Yeah, okay. We can do this the old fashioned way. Not bad. Oh, yes, on that, there's actually someone who comes in and dislikes all my videos because they're a mod. And the first time he told me that he was going to do it, he, he said disliking because of exclusivity. And I called him delusional. <laughs> and now he comes to every one of my videos uh, to dislike them. Not everyone. He can't keep up with me. No one can keep up with my... Like, I get it. Look, all he, I know that all he has to do is dislike it, but even he can't keep up with the dislikes. Third IJ, welcome to the stream, brother. We're, we got double penetrating uncapped herald. Hoping to make it work here. We've gone through a couple iterations of in stage one of different kinds of... Go ahead, do your worst. Go ahead and dot me, homie. All you're going to do is make me mad. I'll become more powerful than you can possibly imagine. I had a really good run going uh, just now, but unfortunately, I killed myself with kunai. Okay, take this, cleanse my debuff up a little bit. There we go. Running out of pistol ammo. All right, now spider ants. It's oh now now it's over. This is what I've been waiting for. A little power up action. There we go. Down goes Petimus Prime. Let's go. Yeah, two fang is so satisfying. True, I do got two fang. It's really helping me out. Sponge, dude, get out of here. I don't like you anymore. 
We'll interface her though. Okay. Interface is really good for boar. Anything else, Pyro Pete? Come on, brother. You're known for giving some of the best loot. I, I, I've been hyping you up every time. But no loot is no loot, man. No loot is no loot. Oh, here we go. What is this? Hey, almost missed it. Okay, okay, respect. Best power ups are melee and grenade ones. Throwing a Merv with a grenade power up is sad, so satisfying. Honestly, I do like the Mervs. But the best ones, in my opinion, is by far and away transfusions. All right, let's go to the next one. Let's see. Uh, just what what is this mode? Actually, is this mode of the actual game? I haven't played Borderlands two in years, and I'm on console, so I don't get access to mods. Yeah, I'm sorry, bro. That's what it is. Quick one shot this puzzle. So easy. Uh, fair play man thank you for letting me know i can get i can get it to be honest but looks oh i can't get it to be honest but looks pretty awesome can't lie yeah it's a really cool game mod and what's awesome is that pyrex and jolt Studio are going to keep making major updates to it all right let's rock <laughs> matson's in chat he's like no no they're not i told you that's not big updates only bug fixes. No, that's the, that's the craziest part about it is that they're making big updates to it. Oh, am I going to get my revenge on this zone? Oh, this is where my last... One of my last runs went to die. Okay. A crazed swabby. Lead your shots. Lead your shots. All right, so we go for Hector's Paradise um, from, from, from a distance. One of my favorite pistols in the game. Hector's Paradise is probably... Uh, if, if I had to put my money down for my favorite pistol, I'd probably put give it to Hex, Hexer's Paradise number one. Whoa, whoa, whoa. How in the world did that proc my grit? Toss this. Live, 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 live. Live, live. There we go. Transfusions come back to me, homie. And then when we get up a little bit closer, we can double penetrating up Count Herald. Here we go. More mini bosses would be great. True. I w personally like optimal for me would be just one raid boss per run. Let's see. Melee override, max health. Nope. Do I have anything better? Do I have explosive damage or something like that? Oh, I do have explosive damage, ladies and gentlemen. Make sure I got the right one on. Yep. Sick. I would love having mini bosses as common uh, enemy as a common enemy in any round. There is an update that I might do. I don't want to go overboard with the mods, but there is a mod that spawns in random giant enemies. And if it, if it has if it has synergy with this game mode, that could be pretty crazy. Okay, cowboy rifle. Our next five. I, I, at some point, I gotta get down this skill tree, right? Surely. But at some point, maybe I don't. <laughs> so I can, I want do or die. Give me some more grenade damage. Let's rock, let's rock today. Giant enemies drop legendaries. Oh, okay, I don't want to make it too broken then. I don't want to make it too broken. Have you tried most of Azure Lands with Rogue Lands? No, I have not tried Azure Lands with Rogue Lands. I could try. The only thing is that I've I've only really been doing Python SDK mods because they're much simpler to get up and running. Um, I don't want to be here trying for 20 years to try to get the other ones working. Oh, now you guys really messed up. There we go. Keep deceptioning. Kill the front guy and the back guy at the same time here. Keep it. Uh, keep moving. Keep moving quickly throughout the stages. Oh, I'm oh, pretty sure. Oh, it is. Is an, is a Python SDK mod. There's others as well. I might. I might give it a shot. I don't want to get too far away from the vanilla experience, but you know what? It could be something I'm interested in. A singularity is good. Okay, deception out. Deception allows me to, to close the gap on the enemies without them knowing where I'm at. So. 
the hardest part about using something like an unkept herald is the fact that enemies uh ding you up as you're trying to get, close the gap so all right so we go preparation here for sure and then it's probably none of this really matters except for recompense yeah we'll get there we're making it we'll stick with the creamer Okay, so let's grab the Borderlands symbol up top. I'm I'm really looking for. I'm really looking for maybe a sheriff's badge would be kind of sick. Maybe a better explosive damage relic could be good too. Let's see, deputy's badge could be good with an interfacer. Oh, I know where the the pressure pad is on this map too, but it's tier two pressure pads. Kind of dog. Jump shot with Harold. It usually helps. Land shots. Okay, I could try that. Go. I enjoy Super Randomizer, but I don't know if it works on Rogue Lands. I don't know if it works on Rogue Lands either. Well, the Super Randomizer. Um, does that randomize all the? Oh, let's just grab this and and, and speed run this round. Direct. Hey, don't block me. Where are you? You're up here. I see you. Thought you could survive. You cannot. There we go. Oh, yeah. Good. Oh, Curse Pirate? No, not this time. Not this time, homie. Curse Pirate? Probably my number one most hated enemy. Okay. Five more enemies to kill. This is kind of a long zone, though. It does. Okay, I could give it a shot. What does the what does the super randomizer do? What do, what does it all entail? Someone someone give me the deets. Deception on cooldown. Randomizes enemies, their weapons, and weapon parts. Wait, someone said that's the Jolt's candy. Third Eye J. Sorry, Third Eye J. That's the that's actually the Juso's candy, I believe. Can I can I get a, a Mikey Dubs candy out of the game, please? Randomize enemies, their weapons, and weapon parts. That could be interesting. That could definitely be interesting. Okay, so. Which skills matter here? They don't really. But now that I got that, I'm feeling pretty good. Let's do Immolate. Oh, I don't have any more points. All right, let's rock. Let's rock today. You can basically get a Norfleet Infinity if you're insanely lucky. Oh, I see. So weapon parts, can did this get completely randomized? Very interesting. So how would you know what's good? Is, did you have to try everything out or what? I mean, I'm, I'm interested. You're, you're speaking my language. Okay, don't die here, brother. Oh, okay. Somehow that didn't give me a revive. Okay. Oh, nice try. Nice try, game. But I'm not going down that easy. Save that uh, power for next round. You just try everything that drops. Okay. Oh, deception out while I reload. This guy, he likes to hide behind this box. Oh, nice mortars, brother. Hey. Hey. Uh-oh, this is danger. I'm in danger zone. I'm in danger zone. Need to start tossing grenades. Get away from me. Where's my deception? Oh, gosh. If he puts me down, I'm dead. Heartbreaker me. Heartbreaker. Why is he so tanky? He's so hard to hit and all that. Everything about him is, is difficult. He's so tanky. What in the world? Deception? I'm going to get right up on him. There's no way he lives this, right? Surely? There we go. Down goes Frazier. You can't get a healing infinity. Infinite, per, for example. You can, you can only get one or the other. Not so sure what you mean. Okay, so let's do. I mean, that would be good, but let's take a little bit of health regen. Start going, getting towards that, and get this power, get this candy, healing, moxie infinity. Read my previous comment. 
Web okay, yeah, you gotta try. Also, please note that weapons' unique abilities are tied to the barrel of the gun, like the infinity being infinite. I see, so because the barrel, so the unique abilities are tied to the barrel, so you can't get a, a grog nozzle infinity. But let me ask you this. The grog nozzle has that unique ability of healing and the unique ability of, oh my gosh, see you later. Forgot that I got that power up, see you later. It also has unique ability of giving you the extra pellets. So which one, which one are they, are both those abilities tied to the barrel or no? Yes, it is tied to the barrel. Okay. Yes or no? So you can only get one... You can only get one unique effect per weapon. But the Grog Nozzle rolls two. So I can get... Wait, I can get the Grog Nozzle barrel on... I, the Grog Nozzle barrel would go crazy on something. Correct? Am I thinking about this correctly? It would give me healing and grog nozzle. Um, extra pellets. Okay, so the barrels to look out for are things like the infinity, things like the... The grog nozzle. Understood. I think, honestly, the randomizer... The super randomizer might go pretty insane. I might try that out. Should we try that out next run? Maybe next run, we throw in the super randomizer. If you want, I can test the super randomizer right now. Yeah, go ahead and try it out. Just drag and drop it. I've, all I'm running is SDK mods. I'm not running a mod manager or anything like that. Oh, toothpick me. Let's go. I definitely need to get some... Some SDUs here. Let's also get some shotgun on the small map. And some Grenage. And one more pull of the box. Oh, here we go. Sniper rifle gun damage. Team critical hit damage. No thanks. Let's roll. Let's see. It, it would give you the slag chance probably, but not the healing and drunk effect. Well, I thought the healing and drunk effect was part of it. All right, let's, let's go to my toothpick. And what do we got here? Sorry for max ammo. It's a little bit late for that. A little bit late for that. Let's go for a cooldown right then. This toothpick should pop off. Hold on, right there we go. Skin customization. No, I do the skin customizations after nowadays. Roman, what's up? I'm a new fan. Well, that's good. Listen, we're all new fans around here, but I'm a new fan of you. Let's rock this. We're having um, someone test out the... Someone offered to test out the super randomizer to see if I can take use it next round. It can be pretty fun. I'm not sure if my computer could handle it, but... Alright, here we go. Not that much damage, honestly. Give me some of those crits. Oh, don't hit me, brother. Maybe the... I think double penetrating on Cup Terrell will do better here. Honestly. Toothpick. Kind of underwhelming. Yeah, we got a pretty nice draw to get Terran Morphous. Come on, where are you at? There you are. Yeah, uh, uh, Cup Terrell definitely does better here. Land on my shots on him too. Don't do anything stupid, brother. Oh, de deception out. Ow, ow, oh. That hurt me. That hurt me a lot. But we live? Oh, we're so back. Okay, wait, I'm definitely dead. I'm definitely dead. I'm definitely dead. This is the end. Only one slap, though. One slap, Terra. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Ooh, I'm knocked up into outer space. To outer space I go. Well, I can bore him though now. Not bad. Oh, that's some, some satisfying bore right there. Only one slap, homie. Thank you. Okay. 
Give me some of that heal juice. I'm above health gate now. Deception out. Go for the go for my clone, please. That's not my clone. That's me. Okay, run into the transfusions as quickly as possible. Well, I might die here. Oh, thank God. Ooh. Do I have slag? I do have slag, but by the time I swap to and back from slag, um, it's gonna go away. Ladies and gentlemen. How can you not run the peak open already get it? Like, the weapon is way too satisfying not to use. In my opinion. Let's go. I have explosive damage relic as well. Let's rock. And I can increase my mag size. I can go even further. Beyond. Ah. Uh... <laughs> I don't have a decent way to slag at all, though, realistically. I, don't, I haven't really gotten a good grenade. Then again, I haven't really been opening all the chests in the game either. Get me up there. It's not GG. The peak opener is not GG because I don't have a way to survive the dragons. Realistically, I've got no way to survive dragons right now. And it doesn't crit. I, I think the un uncapped Terrell will do much, much better. Uh, against dragons. Only the uncapped heralds are way better at bossing than it is at mobbing. Get some gubs. Hey. Thank you. I thought I'd be using any of them. Okay. Let's rock. I have increased assault rifle max ammo too, and I also capped it. What snipers do you have? I don't really have. I have a patriot. That's the only good sniper that I've got. Let's just rock this bad very for a bit. And I'm using this because it's much, much better for mobbing than the Uncapped Herald. Uncapped Herald gets you killed while mobbing a lot, in my opinion. Okay, let this guy start raging. And then use an Uncapped Herald on him. Don't have the explosive damage, but that's okay. If I, if I come across some big enemies like this guy, like large lads... I'm not against going for the uncapped herald at all. Deception out. I don't want to get flanked and spanked by this laddie. Big. I didn't land the kill. Here we go. Drop. Rip ammo. My ammo's fine. I've got max uh, assault rifle SDUs. And I have a plus 70% uh, assault rifle ammo relic. A combo with the peak opener. Yeah, I could go the... I could go the explosive damage relic. But... You know, I, I don't, don't want to go for now because I want to have as much ammo as possible in this thing. Okay. Well, I probably could save ammo by doing more damage. You don't, you don't close the gap on me, brother. It's not going to work out for you. Trust me. Look what, look what happens. Look what you did to yourself. You made a fool of yourself. Well, the boar is coming in hot. Yep. Thank you very much. Look out for mouthwash. Relic. True. I have toothpick. I can also run mouthwash. And I know the, the borderline symbol is in here, so... It's tier 3. I want to be finding as many pressure places as I can. Here we go. Vault symbol. Extra shot chance. Mm, maybe not. And what I would like to do is find the pressure plate here. I think I, I remember where it is. Yeah, it's on top of that. Let's go. Alright, so... Our next five... Let's go into... Follow through or the better half? How about the better half? Yeah. Okay. Up up here. Something good to eat. Hornets, electric chair. Another unicorn explosion. Nope. You can miss me with all that stuff. I mean, the unicorn explosion is decent, but... 
I snooze it for now. Oh, yeah, it's a nice, a nice simple, easy zone. I say that, I'm probably gonna die, but. There we go, you go down. Nice, okay. Let's go back to my peak opener. I'd like to get a grog nozzle or something, but. Later, kid. Best assault rifle damage relic is the mouthwash. I think it, it definitely is the best assault rifle damage relic. But I've actually found myself not taking it as much depending on my build. So if I already have a lot of gun damage, I've been I've been more into just taking elemental relics instead of mouthwash, but. There we go. That was easy. Okay. Where are you? Up there. Come on, guys. There you are. Nice. I think the Unicorn's Poison you rolled casual prefix giving you an extra pellet. Oh, that could be interesting. Let's check it out. Let's see. I don't have any prefix. Yeah, I don't I don't have any prefix at all. Which is unfortunate. Let's take five points into this left side scotch where we get cloud kill now. Uh inconceivable probably goes pretty hard. Chance of free shots. Prefixes don't show on rainbow weapons. Yeah. But I, I would have still said times two, right? All right, what do we get here? Okay, a time. Is that toothpick better than my own? If I could get some better shields, guys. Um, let's equip my toothpick just to see. No. Mine's better. By a decent amount, to be honest with you. Okay, back to the peak opener. We roll. Hey, you missed the third eye, Jay. Matson here gave us the keys to the kingdom where, where to find the patch notes. Well, let's grab this. Where to find the patch notes? I almost, hit the, I, I didn't believe him. I almost hit the ban him, but we found it. We we followed the 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 trail. We followed the the secret trail. Okay. Gotta like peak peak opener. Yes. Go down, homies. Got a feeling this can be a W. This can definitely be a W. The problem is going to be the dragon fight. I don't have a good way to heal up. The best way to heal up right now is is Deputy's Badge Heartbreaker. That's not going to be good enough. Oh, really, homie? Did you, I was going to do it, but you made me do it. Get on, get heralded. Later, kid. Ultimate Badass Sorg Enforcer. Okay. I got, luckily, I got something for you. Oh, don't start hitting me. There we go. Go for him instead. Hey, whoa, that's gonna hurt. Okay, it didn't hurt as bad as I thought it did. I thought it would. There we go. It was the friends we made along the secret trail. True. Alright. Destroy this Torque Biker. Easy mode, easy sauce. Listen, third eye J, if if I didn't find the patch notes, there's a pretty good chance I banned them. Okay. Oh, now you're now you're getting torched, brother. I could definitely go for the explosive damage relic. Oh! Oh grit. Okay, grit saved my life. He's one shotting me. I'm not sure, but you gotta go. Yes, okay. Ooh. Nice try, game. I'll take this heartbreaker just to check the stats versus my own. The game actually let me scroll down this time. It's crazy. 
Heartbreaker, where are you at? Where did you go? Checking the stats against my own. Higher magazine size is better. Damage is better. Higher damage. But the reload speed's kind of a meh. I think I might be a little bit better. Okay, so. Inconceivable. Life tap. Keep my keep me healed up. The only problem with life tap is that it's not that great for dragon fights. Bandit grip is better. Which one did I put on? Yeah, that did. Anti-faction grenade. Anti-faction grenade could be what we need. If I hold a heartbreaker and throw in anti-factions, maybe that'll give me the healing that I need. Yeah, one second longer reload. Yeah, that, as you say it, like I'm starting to think that the the reload's gonna end up getting us killed. So let's swap back. Yeah, I want this. I want the shorter reload speed. Storm, let's see. Storm Phosis says, I'm honestly surprised how many videos you pump out. Enjoying the vids always, though. Yeah, uh, a lot of people would tell you on YouTube not to spam it. Like, hey, don't don't spam. Oh, that's a nice little droog. Hey, you probably shouldn't spam your videos. Um. Oh, Sheriff's Badge. You know what? Let's rock a Sheriff's Badge. Let's go. And there's probably something to that. Uh, me personally, and it's been working for me so far, I'm spamming it. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be spamming because to me like yeah I I lose subs every day like you say you'll, oh you'll lose subs people won't click blah 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 like you should focus on quantity over qual quality over quantity and all, there's all different kinds of things that you could say um since I didn't get the but at the end of the day like oh come on where's my grenade damage come on the grenade damage should come come in clutch here right surely Yeah, at the end of the day, I, I should be fine. Oh my gosh, this is danger, danger, Will Robbins, in danger. Sheriff spadge me, and we uncapped Harold. Uncapped Harold, please die. Oh, I don't have the damage. Ah! Um, is it? Ex should I explosive damage relic? Oh, but I can wait. Hold on, I'm a zombies player. I'm a zombies player. I can do this. Whoa. Everything is fine. Okay. Very nice. Yeah, the idea is to have to give you guys a, a video to go to sleep to, a video to wake up and drive to work to, a video to watch on your lunch break. Like, there's never not one up. Uh, okay. Let's rock, let's rock today. Oh, yeah, there's always going to be a new release. Every time you click YouTube, I'm there. I'm there. That's the point. Like, for people, the thing is, like, okay, people that enjoy your content, they're going to want more of it. So why not give them more of it? They get cloud killed, brother. Oh, get ready to learn it, brother. Okay, let's kill this guy because he's flanking me. Where's my damage? Ah! No. Very, very bad. Very, very good. I got life tap now. And a whole bunch of reload speed and all that stuff. Or uh, fire rate. There we go. Oh, yeah. Go ahead and drop down. There we go. Life tap, get me up. Don't don't die in the, in the fire of the flames. Oh. Okay. Everything is fine. Everything is completely fine. All right, Mad Mike. I know, I know you're going to pop out now. Well, okay. I'm, I'm scared now. I think if I kill this guy, Mad Mike appears. Paying attention? No, I have to kill one more. Okay, okay. Ooh. Everything is fine. No, I can't, I can't detonate. I can't detonate anymore. 1.0.9 update, brother. 1.0.9. 1.0.9. Okay. You can't kill me. I'm too strong. You can't kill me. I'm too strong. Okay. I took, I took Emily, right? Yes, I did. I believe I did. Sorry, Mad Mike. Boom. Look, I can stand right on top of this grenade. Nothing will happen to me. Throw some transfusions. No time. No time. Okay, so. Five points. 
We're definitely going to be doing a respec. Oh, I didn't take Immolate. Oh, uh. No cringe there, then. Let's see. Cooldown rate, critical hit damage, and reload speed. That is exactly what we're looking for. Oh, but... That pistol gun damage is nice, too. Uh, let's rock. One more boss before the final. And it's Doc Mercy. This should be pretty simple. I got a good weapon for him. Let's do it. In Deception, throw your grenades. Good idea. Also, I should probably I should probably be rocking a different grenade right now. Is it anti-affection or electric chair? I think it's electric chair because then I won't die. What I can do is I can deception and throw throw grenades and that'll heal me. But I also have life tap for healing too, so I have a lot of life steal now. Hey, okay, don't die to my own grenades here. Okay. The melee. Oh, okay, wasn't enough. Wasn't enough. Wasn't enough. No. How could you? Emily, get me there. Emily, get me there. Emily's gonna get me there, right? Surely. Yep. Thought so. Yep. We're there. Oh, we're so back. We're so back. Okay. Toss deception out. Let me throw an extra chair grenade. I can't see anything. We're so we're so fine here. We're so fine. Heartbreaker me. Electric chair me. There we go. Can we back up? You don't got nothing. You don't got nothing, homie. You put me down, I'll become more powerful than you could possibly imagine. Right? Surely. Quick reload. Yep, we're so fine. It's crazy how fine we are. Super, the super randomizer seems to work, but there's a strange process to get it to work. All right, well, I would like to, I would like to try it. Don't know how I, would, I just don't know how to get it to work. Okay, it's time. It's time for El Dragons. Oh, cut my reward. B shield. Ah. Uh. Okay. Oof. I just don't know if this... Don't get your hopes up. Do you have, like, 1,000 mod saves in your mod screen after each run? Um, I do, but I, I cleared them out the other day. By deleting the mod. Get some more Grenage. Alright, let's do it. Hmm, not good, man. Come on, be shield me? Whiskey Tango. Oh, the Cradle and the Sham. Sham, not effective. Well, we tried. Let's rock, let's rock today. I'm probably gonna get a respec in here. Realistically, what's gonna be the best for me? I Less kill skills. Probably. Let's go... Preparation, boar, ambush... Lay waste. Recompense. Might as well. Do or die. Ranger for five. And cooking up trouble. Okay, so. Let's get it into quick draw. Foresight. Two fang. Ritz. Mylan. Immolate. Good. Should I keep going for Cloud Kill? Asbestos. Asbestos and better half. So, now that we're here and we know that we don't have... We don't, we don't have the skill points to get everything we want, okay? So, what can we drop? Deathmark gives you more crit damage. No, it doesn't. I'm not going to melee a dragon. But what if we did? Um. 
Do we take any kill skills that I can drop? We need this one to get down to do or die. So we can't really drop that kill skill. I question how that 80% works out for, for damage mats. Well, it's, an, it's a multiplicative damage bonus, but I just don't know if I can... You know what? Listen, I've done so many dragon fights. Let's take Death Mark. Sure. Right, foresight, Twin Fang, Grit. Stop there for now. Uh, Mylan, yeah, that'll be helpful. Lay Waste, Boar, Preparation, Ambush. Recompense, do or die, and stop. This will probably give us the points that we want to make it down this tree a little bit further for asbestos, for better half, for cloud kill. Hmm. Inconceivable. And then two points. In okay. So we need to be able to get. If we can get a dragon down, and let's get it down with, let's get it down with something that is consistent, a Maggie. Let's use a Maggie to get this dragon down. Then hopefully we can, I can deception, melee. What's up, King of Koi? So you came in during a dragon fight, so fasten your seatbelts. This could go really well, it could go really horribly. All right, get this bad boy down. Deception out, I need the deception early here. I can't make it right away, but I am going to go for a melee. Come on. Juke, get death marked. Get all the death mark. It's all worth. It's so worth. It's so worth. Yep, 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 yep. Dying, 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 dying. Living. Living. That's the best part. That we're actually living. Oh, no. We go down. Oh, we come back. Okay, blue is down. Let's go ahead and melee this lad. Get meleeed and slapped. Good. Okay, that hurts. That hurts me. That hurts me. Stop it. Mm, the, the that this grenade isn't gonna be that great for me. Man, should I really use an anti-faction? Probably not. Okay. May. Oh, keep me alive. Keep me alive. Oh boy. Oh boy. No! No, no, no. Come on. Get me there. Get me there. Are there any small lads? I don't, I don't think there's any small lads. No! Come back! Come back! Well. It was a good run. We had a good time. We, the death mark definitely came in and... It, we did our best, but... At the end of the day, it wasn't quite enough. Anyways, if you enjoyed this video, hit the like button. Subscribe to see more videos like this one. And I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!